So basically, we've been playing Warzone over the last couple of months because you guys kept requesting it, and I, admittedly, I liked Warzone in Modern Warfare 2 until they updated it this week, and when they did update it for Season 2, I just don't like it anymore. It feels like Warzone has turned into uh, a game mode that really, unless you're one of these people who absolutely positively is so hardcore into Call of Duty, and you're going to be playing this many times a week, and you're building your best absolute custom loadouts, and you know all the best places on the map to either drop and grab weapons quickly in camp, it just doesn't seem fun anymore. To, just to give you some perspective, in Season 1 of Warzone, you would drop, and it was completely randomized. You don't know if you're going to get armor, you don't know if you're going to find a backpack, an auto-revive, money... It's rare that anyone would get a really good loadout right off the bat. You'd have to be very lucky. And so, to survive until, like, the final ring would be very rare. You know, when you get down to that final ring, you probably have maybe 20 to 15 people tops. And you're like, wow, you're, like, right in the top 10 if you survive that long. <clears throat> now, everyone playing this immediately starts with armor. Everyone's finding decent weapons right away. And there's tons of money everywhere in this new war zone because of that everyone can buy their loadouts right away so as long as you built a custom loadout that's really really good you can now buy all the best things and have it within 10 15 minutes of war zone so everyone's fully loaded locked and loaded and they start camping in the best spots it's it's literally the opposite uh the opposite situation from what made war zone good it, it, it feels like they changed the entirety of the game. That's sad. Because, you know, when I play Warzone, I like interacting with you guys. I like the suspense of building up to the final ring if I can make to it. I'm never going to do that now. So, after seeing these changes and having played it the other day, I was like, wow, I don't think I'm ever playing it again. But then you guys urged me. You said, please, at least play the multiplayer. Do some multiplayer. You haven't done multiplayer in months, and we like Modern Warfare 2, so do it. Now, here's the thing. I know that from when I was playing multiplayer actively in November and December, you guys criticized it because the multiplayer of the game is very action-packed. There's almost no dead time or downtime. i got to be paying attention constantly, which means I don't have time to talk with you guys, interact, give you shout-outs, answer your questions, and have discussion. Instead, the focus is solely on the game. So it's basically hit or miss because some people like that, and if the action's going well and if I'm doing well, then it's more interesting. But if you get a night where... Connections are bad, I'm sucking, and I'm frustrated. I'm not doing well. Well, I'm also not talking to you, so it ends up being a dud, all right? Last night, incidentally, we did the, the multiplayer, and my intention was that this would be the final stream of Modern Warfare 2 for me. I had a good time, actually. Surprisingly, the connections were much better than I expected. They were much better than any Warzone connection I've gotten in the last couple of months. I was actively able to swap out weapons and, and, and do things fast and get kill streaks. Um, it was quite fun. People were actually enjoying when I was going on a tear and getting these kill streaks. I even got a chopper gunner. Um, the new maps are all right. I'm not in love with them or anything. And they're actually kind of hard to get in the rotation because they put them into a mosh pit. But the mosh pit has shitty game modes that no one plays, like headquarters. So it's stupid because, like, oh, I want to play the new maps. This is amazing. Oh, to play the new maps, I have to play game modes I hate, right? So it was kind of a mixed bag, I would say. But overall, I did enjoy the stream. Now, here's the thing about when I play Modern Warfare 2. It definitely brings out the trolls. The, the shitheads come out in droves. They want to crap all over it. They want to harass. This is the other thing. I'm trying to play. And they're coming in here and they're harassing other viewers and harassing, you know, people on the stream. It's like, it's, is it really worth it to play this multiplayer game just to bring out more shitheads? You know? It's annoying. I just want to have a good time with the game, and I can't because i got to keep turning back to the chat and everyone in chat, Phil, help us because this troll is here, this troll is here. You know, it just so happens it was a rare night. We didn't really have a moderator around, so it sucked. Okay, I'm not going to lie. So, uh, overall, I did not hate last night's stream at all. I actually had a good time. I would like to maybe once in a while, if we have an open night with nothing going on or if I want to break up, the schedule of the same stuff over and over that we're working on, I would like the ability to maybe go back and do a multiplayer stream of Modern Warfare 2 every once in a while. So I kind of made the decision last night that I would, for now, not say, okay, that was the final stream ever of Modern Warfare. Maybe we'll go back to it from time to time, okay? So I think that'll appease people every once in a while. I break everything up. At the same time, though, let's be honest, it wasn't the most well-supported stream either. 
it seemed like there was a lot more people on the stream, but they were here to troll rather than anything else. They weren't here to be positive influences. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it would have been great if more people would have shown up and said, oh, my God, he's playing Modern Warfare multiplayer. I haven't seen that in months. I'll support it. It really wasn't like that. It was kind of like the regular crowd doing the regular amount of everything. So, uh, you know, that's why I said I'll, every once in a while I'll bring it back. <clears throat> but certainly, when I'm in a situation with all the games that we're juggling right now and we're about to bring new releases into the mix, it's not going to be even a thought in my head to say, oh, take off a night stream from that so I could squeeze in Modern Warfare. Absolutely not. Okay. So there you go. Not the end of Modern Warfare 2. I'm not deleting the game or drawing the line. I'm just saying, eh, maybe every once in a while for variety purposes. Okay? So if you guys get bored of stuff and you want to see me bring back Modern Warfare, by all means, let me know. Okay? Cool? Okay. 